Europejski Kongres Gospodarczy w Katowicach, Studio Rzeczpospolitej. Wita Państwa Marcin Piasecki, jest ze mną gość, pan Lars Ipsen, dyrektor zarządzający Stena Recykling. Dzień dobry. Dzień dobry. At what stage of development of the circular economy we are, in your opinion? I think we are in the first steps, in the beginning, with a long and interesting uh, road ahead of us. Mm -hmm. Uh, we have several examples uh, at Stena Recycling where we have created uh, circular solutions with uh, our clients, mm -hmm. uh, but still a lot to be done ahead of us. Mm -hmm. And what the situation is in Poland? I think in Poland we are also uh, on a good track. We have uh, different corporations with clients in, uh, in Europe. Mm -hmm. uh, and in Poland we are also taking uh, the first steps. So we... Uh, in, depending on the industries, we are maybe a little behind, uh, but uh, in other areas, we are at least on the level uh, which we have experience with uh, as thin recycling in the Nordic countries or in mm -hmm. Germany and Italy, where we are present. Mm -hmm. And what are the most important uh, uh, challenges uh, connecting with uh, circular economy, in your opinion? I think the, the biggest challenge is to get the people together, to get companies together in order to find solutions. Mm -hmm. Because this is not something you can do alone. You need to work more people together. There at Stena Resign, we pay, we see an important role and obligation from our side. Another thing is, uh, is legislation. We need also both Polish and European legislation to push industries and consumers, mm -hmm. uh, consumers to demand, but also industries to develop uh, circular solutions. And what is the uh, Stella Recycling role in this business? We of course uh, have been in the waste management uh, and recycling material, uh, end of life uh, products into new raw materials for many, many, many years. And we see our whole role also in when it comes to creating circularity in establishing contact between manufacturers of uh, finished products and manufacturers of raw materials to their products and our, ourselves as a, a company who can uh, collect and, and sort and deliver raw materials, uh, new raw materials for the, for the producers of various products. We see we play an important role just both in establishing the collaboration and also providing a lot of knowledge which we have in uh, our daily waste management uh, operations. Mm -hmm. And what investments are you planning in Poland? Uh, right now we are investing in, uh, in uh, further processes, uh, downstream processes, we call it in uh, plastics, mm -hmm. from packaging materials or electronics. We are doing mm -hmm. some investments. We have a, a big site in uh, Wschowa near Lesno, where we have made a line which, where we produce LDPE granules out of uh, packaging materials. So when you have a packaging material from various goods, we take the foils in, we sort them, we shred them and wash them and cleaning and produce uh, granules which can be reused in, uh, in new products. Mm -hmm. And also we have, uh, on that side, we have done investments in uh, further processing electronics of small domestic appliances where also both we take out metals and precious metals like gold and palladium, mm -hmm. but also normal other metals and plastics. Also there we are doing quite big investments. Mm -hmm. And in, uh, on the elect uh, electromobility side, we uh, have uh, established last year the battery center yes. where we collect uh, uh, lithium-ion batteries mm -hmm. uh, from electric cars or from the producers of uh, these batteries mm -hmm. in Poland. Mm -hmm. uh, and there we, uh, we do the dismantling and decharging, and then we send it to our site in Halmstad, where um, we have just opened a new site. We call it the Phase 2. We invested more than 100 million Swedish kroner in the, in the process of uh, dismantling uh, lithium-ion batteries from electric cars even further uh, in order to take uh, all the metals and plastics out of that and reuse them in new batteries. Are the batteries uh, from the electric cars is a new challenge uh, uh, of um, uh, sustainability? Uh, very much. Yes. And I think it's very interesting discussions mm -hmm. we have because mm -hmm. the volumes are not there yet there, but we as manufacturers and players in this industry, we have to take the risk and do the first big investments like we are doing mm -hmm. without knowing exactly where with the legislation go 
and exactly where, how will the technology also in the future go? So that is, uh, that's a big challenge, but also very interesting. <laughs> big challenge, but yeah. interesting. Yeah. Bardzo dziękuję za rozmowę. Moim gościem był pan Lars Ibsen, dyrektor zarządzający Stena Recykling. Jeszcze raz dziękuję. Dziękuję bardzo.